there are coming down that street six fighting bulls. And this maddened mass of humanity. It is life and death, and it's a risk, and it's a challenge, and it's wonderful. In Pamplona for seven days, you know, you get to be Peter Pan, you get to run around and do something totally insane. You know, Hemingway said the greatest thing in the world is to be shot at and missed. And that's what running bulls is like. We have, in this uh, 21st century, a very organized life. We have insurance all around us. Everything is so organized and prepared. But if you run the bulls, sometimes tragedy happens. Today, in Pamplona, we have five dead people in the same morning. I'm sure that the European Union is going to forbid it. I'm sure of that. And I'm sure that my grandsons will not see the bull running. You're going through your normal preparations. You, everyone has their own little things that they do to prepare, to get yourself mentally ready. You go through rituals. But then when it gets starting to be closer to that 8 o'clock straight up, closer and closer, uh, your, your heart is pounding. Your adrenaline's starting to, to, uh, to come to your head and your body. Finally, when that rocket goes off, I don't know what it is. When you hear that explosion, all that anxiety just goes away. And it just becomes something that you've done this, you know what to do, you want to do it right, and, and that just takes over. I see the bulls, then I'm all right. I'm not nervous, I'm not afraid, I feel no fear. I'm thinking, which is what you better be doing in there, be aware and think. It is a mind over matter game. Stay in there, hold the center of the street, which is the best place you can be because it's a funnel. If you're there, you can run freely. As soon as you get to the side, that's when the elbows are flying, the people who are panicking are grabbing at you. It took me a long time, mind over matter, to convince my body to hold the center.